DA Chief Whip Seviwe Guadrube has hit back at President Ramaphosa's reliance on the life of Tinsualo as an analogy for the ANC's wins since 1994. She says this shows that Ramaphosa is out of touch uh, with the sobering situation facing the country's young people. Instead, Guadrube tells a story of Tabang to describe South Africa's reality. I would like to perhaps assist the president to understand how the other side lives. I would like to introduce him to real stories of real South Africans. His fictional character, Tinsualo, a child born without democracy, is an exception and not the rule. In this country, the reality of young people is too bleak for words. Let me introduce you to Tabang, Mr. President, a 29-year-old man born in 1995. His family has lived in Alexandra all his life, and his entire worldview is characterized by lack, by poor service delivery, joblessness, and hopelessness. None of his family members have made it out or escaped the clutches of poverty. And under the Ramaphosa presidency, there's no hope that he ever will. Despite his matric qualification, he's unlikely to ever get an opportunity to study further or get a job that will give him a life of the dignity that he deserves. In fact, he was there, Mr. President. He was there when, in the heat of an election campaign, you, Mr. Prom Mr. President, promised the people of Alex one million new homes. He watches with dismay when you speak tough on corruption, yet your very own Deputy President, Paul Mashatile, has been embroiled in the looting of money meant for the Alex Renewal Project.